Hello guys, this is Richard Rich TV and welcome back to my channel. But before I start the devotional guys, I would like to shout out the following person on our channel na punta rito at nag-join sa devotional natin the other night. Shout out and God bless to Ariel Apor, Juan Anthony Balmoria, Hart Brilieta, Harry Glaze Velos, Monique Killiamore, Connie Blog, Hart Ponsalan, Pamilya Lagan Channel, Yans TV, and even to those who did not join as during the premiere but still na punta rito para makinig at manood sa devotional. God bless us all, guys. Thanks God, it's Friday, no? makapagpahinga na naman tayo. Uh, bukas, tapos na yung pag-aaral ng mga estudyante, pero na lang yung may mga make-up for Saturday, like college na may ROTC, WT, sa kung ano-ano pa. No? Sa mga natatrabaho from Monday to Friday, let's take it as a relax. No? Kung pili, ano, go far Uh, see if oh, go farthest way or come farthest out. <laughs> Kaya ano, para makapag-relax tayo. Malayo sa bahay. Kaya lang magastos na. Okay guys, let's now proceed to our devotional. Let's open our Bible to John 15 verse 5 to 8. Still guys, I'm using the devotional study Bible because the words you see is to simplify the maintain the hand natin. Okay, this is about the vine and the branches. So the word of the Lord in John 15, 5-8 says, I am the vine, you are the branches. If a man remains in me and I in him, he will be your much fruit. Apart from me, you can do nothing. If anyone does not remain in me, he is like a branch that is thrown away and withers. Such branches are picked up, thrown into the fire and burned. If you remain in me and my words remain in you, ask to whatever you wish and it will be given you this is to my father's glory that you be here much fruit showing yourselves to be my disciples wow well, ang ganda talaga ng words guys no i guess let's now pray <clears throat> father god napakaganda ng mga promise na binigay mo sa amin oh god tonight lord you are the vine and we're just our branches Totoo, God, na kung hindi kami part sa pagka-branch mo, Lord God, we will be prone, cut off, and thrown into the fire, O oh God, because we're not useful. But if we are being prone, O oh God, then we will really uh, produce much fruit. Lord, nap napaganda na promise mo, O oh God, that we will, if we remain in you, we can ask anything in your name. That's right. Lord, I pray marami sa amin, O oh God, na may hinihingi, dear God. Lord, I pray for those who are here na they will be convicted also to, to keep asking you to go near you, to attach unto your branch, O oh God, so our prayer become effective. Lord, for me, I experience you again, O oh God, for this week and last week. And thank you for such a uh, blessing you have given me, O oh God. Lord, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We commit all these things to you. In this name, I pray. Amen and amen. Okay, guys, our focus verse for this evening is found in John 15, 5, and it says, If I am, I am the vine, you are the branches. If you remain in me and I in you, you will be here. Much fruit. Wow! This is what I wanted to do, no? Na ako talaga ay mamunga. Okay, so the title of our devotion for this evening is Fruit Juice. A thrift store bargain, the lamps seem perfect for my home office. The right color, size, and price. Back at home, however, when I plug in the cord, <laughs> nothing happened. No light, no power, no juice. <laughs> no problem, my husband assured me. I can fix that easy. As he took the lamp apart, he saw the trouble immediately. The plug wasn't connected to anything. Without worrying to a source of power, the perfect 
little lamp was useless. The same is true for us. Jesus told his disciples, I am the vine, you are the branches. If you remain in me and I in you, you will bear much fruit. But then he added this reminder, apart from me, you can do nothing. Yes, guys, that's really too true. This teaching was given in a group, great growing region. So his disciples readily understood Grape wines are hardly plants. Under branches tolerate vigorous pruning. Cut off from their life source, however, the branches are worthless, dead wood, so it is with us. As we remain in Jesus and let his word dwell in us, we are wired to our life source, Christ himself. This is to my Father's glory, said Jesus that you bear much fruit showing yourselves to my disciples says a fruit outcome needs daily nourishment however freely god provides it through the scriptures and his love so plug in and let the juice flow amen and amen yes guys no yung feeling natin na ako ay really parang experience ko to na so ko, Lord, I have been working so hard, but yet, ganito pa rin yung condition ko. <laughs> Ganon, no? parang hindi productive, no? So, I'm so happy with this uh, verse na if we remain, no, sa kanya, we will bear much fruit. Kasi He is the vine. He is the source of our nutrients, no? But if we remain in God, yun, productive productive talaga tayo. Pero, hindi ko naman nasabi na hindi ako productive because, alam ko, productive ako. And I know, God knows also that I am productive. Because without God, guys, no, hindi talaga tayo productive. No matter how much we work hard, wala. Wala talaga mangyayari sa buhay natin. Kaya, let's be productive. Let's go near to God and Maanin natin yung mga fruits of our labor. I guess it's not proceeded to question, what does it mean for you to remain in Jesus? Guys, natatakot ako kung wala si Jesus. Kasi ayoko maging palpak yung mga trabaho ko. Ayoko maging palpak yung day ko. Kaya I always wanted to go near to God. No? Kaya I always wanted to cling on to God. Second question, how has He equipped you? To bear fruit for Him. Yung daily devotional, no, may na-discover na naman ako na bago na naman and I'm so happy na nagawa ko yun kaya I have to do it. Hindi <laughs> ko lang masabi muna sa inyo. Devotional, prayer, reading the Bible, yun. No? The, uh, meditating on God's Word, yun. And basta, I have to apply the thing I have discovered again yesterday. Okay, guys, let's not, pros uh, let's, let's not pray. I mean, all-powerful God, empower us to remain in you and allow your loving word to yield good fruit in us. Amen and amen. Yes, guys, let's be fruitful. Let's remain on the branch because we are just a vine. Because without God, we can really do nothing. God bless us all, guys, because you know, God will surely bless us ten times better. This again, Richard Rich TV. Kita-kita tayo mulit tayo sa muli. Paalam!